to episode number one of the survey to go basic training my name is David and I'm going to be your host and I'm a scripting manager here in Dublo and in case you didn't know Dublo has a scripting department we script well over 200 projects every year for customers and if you'd like us to script your survey simply send us the survey word document and um, we'll do that for you and you can contact me at support at dublo.com now in, these, in this episode, and in the ones that follow, we're going to go over a, a demo questionnaire and we'll script the parts of the questionnaire. In this episode, I'm just going to do the intro um, section of the questionnaire and in later ones, we'll cover other parts as well. Now throughout the episodes, I'm going to share with you best, best practices as well. So hopefully you're going to learn a lot through these sessions. So let's get started with this questionnaire. So in our case, we're scripting this um, demo vehicle survey. And in this specific episode, we're just going to script this intro section. Now in later episodes, we're going to script the screening parts and the main questionnaire, but that's going to come in later on. So today, I'll start with these two um, simple questions. And the first best practice I'm going to share with you is I'm going to do that in two passes. The first pass will be just adding the questions to the survey and then only later on am I going to add the actual scripting parts um, to the script and that makes it so much easier because in the first step I'm just adding the questions and then the second step I'm just adding the logic. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and add the uh, questions now and I'll join you in a minute once I'm ready to add the actual scripts. So I'm done adding the questions and I don't know if you noticed but I also add this introduction chapter which makes it much more easier to navigate later on when we, when we have the scripting or sorry the screening in the main sections and I don't know if you noticed but both uh, adding the topics and adding the actual answers here I've used a multi add button and that allows me to add multiple answers at once or multiple topics at once now we want to start adding the scripting instructions so the first one tells us to uh, ensure the telephone number is only digits and the email address is a valid a email address format so let's do that I'll switch over to the open-ended grid question and I'll go over to the rules tab and I'll add some validation rules right here so the first one would be to check that the telephone number is only digits so we have the is all digits functions and I'm gonna pass to it the telephone number by using the answer choice um, function and I'll give that the current question and I'll say it's topic number five and the reason it's topic number five because I have um, one two three four five until I reach the telephone number topic so this will check if it's all only digits now I want to make sure that in case it's not I'm going to uh, pop up a message saying um, please enter numbers as telephone um, in the telephone field all right so that's the first validation rule we're going to add the second one is for the actual email address so we have the is email function and again I'll use the answer choice of the current question comma topic number six which is our email address right here and I'm gonna say if it is not an email format I'll pop up a message saying please enter proper email format all right, so we're done with this, and now we're gonna head over to the next question. So I need to make sure now that if a person answers yes to the participant, um, we're gonna allow it to continue, and if not, we'll close the interview. So let's do that just now. I'll head over to my second question, and in here I'm gonna add a branching rule. So I'll add a rule saying that if the answer of this question equals 
2, which is no. All right. And in that case, I'm going to say that the action would be to cancel. So um, this is all the scripting I need to put in place. And now I'll actually test out the script. So just to assist me with testing, I'm going to add a question, which is going to be an, sorry, an open-ended question or an, a, uh, an empty question. And that's going to be a message saying, if you are here, you chose to continue. And that's just going to help me when I'm going to test the um, logic of question number two. So to test everything I'm going to click on the run an emulator button and that will spin up the emulator for me and as soon as I do that I have access to the actual emulator which allows me to test out the logic. So the first thing I'm going to do I'm going to add some data here and see if my rules are working. The first um, rule seems to work. Please enter a number in the telephone field. So let's switch that to numbers. And I'll try to continue. And it asked me to enter proper email address. So I'll put in david at google.com. And I'm allowed to pass. So this is working OK. Now, am I willing to participate? If I answer yes, I see that I continue, so um, this is working okay. And we'll also go back and test the no, and it tells me that the survey was canceled. All right, so everything seems to be working uh, okay. And by the way, a quick question, or a quick um, productivity feature that we have. If I wanted to only check question number two, I could have just immediately double clicked on this question on the questions tree and immediately navigate to question number two. So this makes um, testing much more productive because you can skip entire sections and immediately test the question that you're looking for. So this was everything for episode number one. Um, please do join me on episode number two where we're going to start doing the screening sections with a lot more questions and a lot more logic and more best practices that I can share with you and tips and tricks. Now, all of the material for the episode is going to be in the links below, so feel free to download that and script along with me. Um, thank you very much for your time and I'll see you on episode number two.